My name is Jay Grams. My family has owned the Volo Auto Museum since 1960. We have a few hundred of the most exciting collector cars and they're all for sale in one location. I personally have handpicked them from around the country. Welcome to my sales shop. Come on, let's go for a spin. We've got a very unique opportunity to buy an all original 1968 Corvette. It has won the prestigious Benchmark Award, uh, top flight multiple times, the Bloomington Gold, Bloomington Gold Survivor, the McCacken Concourse, uh, Meadowbrook D'Elegance Concourse Award. This is one of the most original vintage Corvettes in existence. Uh, only about 40 Benchmark Awards have ever been given to a 1968 Corvette. I mean, there's things on this car like the wing nut, the belts, even an original battery, not a reproduction, but an original batteries in this car, all original paint. You go to volocars.com, that's where you can read a lot more of the specs and you can look at uh, the documentation that we have, along with about 100 pictures. And that's where you find the prices on all of our collector cars at volocars.com. If you enjoy watching the video, subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, that way you're notified as the new ones are posted. But for right now, top is down, let's go for a spin. Yeah, this is a pretty special car, complete owner history, complete paperwork documentation comes with it. Uh, I'm going to have to cheat on this one and uh, read my notes. The owner that we just acquired it from is an active NCRS judge. He knows this car inside and out. I probably forgot half of what he told me about it, but I'll do my best here. Uh, but the bottom line, it's been looked at and scrutinized by all the experts multiple different times, multiple different Corvette events and uh, it's won all the awards time after time. Uh, as recent as 2018, I think was the most current uh, awards that it won. Uh, give me a second to find it here and I'm gonna read you a little bit about it. And this would be on our website as well. First owner bought it brand new uh, in Chicago, Illinois. He was a broker, he had a good week. He went to the dealership, fell in love. It was the last 68 Corvette on the lot. He bought it, uh, had a son, uh, you know, a family, so he didn't use it much, just took it out on nice days. He owned it till 1990 when he sold it to the second owner with about 35,000 miles. Second owner also had a family, so only took this out occasionally on nice days. The third owner, the judge, uh, bought it in 2016, and right now it has just over 41,000 uh, 41,791 miles on it now. Uh, he bought it with about 41, I believe. And uh, he prepped it for the judging and took it to the shows and comes with all this uh, neat stuff. Uh, we have a box filled with documentation other than what you see here. It has the window sticker and manuals and the original knockouts for the keys. Um, it has you know, window sticker, uh, these are these are protecto plates just for show, these aren't for this car. It does have window sticker, it has award after award, uh, triple diamond at the Muscle Car and Corvette Nationals, uh, Bloomington Gold, uh, this car was used in all sorts of advertisements for the Bloomington Gold sh uh, show. Um, a whole box here of documentation and awards the judging sheets go with the car. So what we've got here uh, underneath is completely original. So when it's won all these awards, doesn't mean it's been taken apart and polished and made glossy. You'll see in our pictures, it's an original underside. It's never been spray painted. It's never been cleaned up. It's just well preserved. It has the original exhaust system. The original shocks are still on this car. The original spare tire carrier still has the spare in there with the lock. Of course, it's a numbers match four speed transmission. Numbers match original 308 Posi, which was an option. Disc brakes at all four wheels has the original brakes on the car. Uh, now the body has never been hit. It's a virgin body with original paint. 
So there's going to be some nicks and scuffs here and there and a little bit of light cracking because it is a lacquer paint job. It presents itself very well, but it's original. We were told don't even buff this car, leave it just the way it is. And everything fits nice because it's never been hit. So this is just how it would have left the factory. Now benchmark, this is the car people look at to judge the others by. This is about one of the most original examples in the country. That's what the benchmark uh, means. Now it didn't come with these optional hubcaps. The original rally wheels are behind there and I have all the original trim. The rally wheel trim will go on these. The owner preferred these uh, wheels. I'm 99% sure he said these are original tires. I don't think they're reproductions. I think they're originals. Um, I'll have to confirm that with him. There's a line, I mean, stuff I would never even know. He did show it to me. There's like a line in the paint back here. Had a neat story. That's the way they came. You can just kind of barely feel it there. Uh, it also has a dealer plate from uh, Maple Motors where it was sold new. That's what that plate is from. And the license plate frame is from that original dealership. Of course, the original antenna. The convertible top is the original. And it's in really good shape. Uh, it was down most of its life. That's why it's in such nice shape. Now, you might have noticed in the corner, we have a hard top. The car did not come with the hard top. That's an added bonus. But that top is original condition, and it's pretty much mint. That'll go with the car. All the vacuum stuff works. Everything works in the car, down to the clock, the radio, the headlights open, the wipers open. It still has the original Chicago City sticker in this original windshield from 1968. Now, he was pointing out things to me. It's just crazy. This little wing nut right here, you can go to a hardware store and buy for 30 cents. He says like eight or 900 bucks. The air cleaner lid is several hundred dollars. The air cleaner filter, I thought he said it was close to a thousand dollars. You just go pointing out all these things that are original to the Corvette expert. There's differences. All the original smog equipment is still here. He said it still has the original belts. Every component on this motor is the original to this car. The interior is in really well-kept condition. It's all original carpet, uh, radio. I mean, nothing's changed in here. The original battery that's in there. He did go out and buy an NOS battery. It's not the one that came with the car, but it is an original correct battery. It even has the vent tubes that go out through the floor. All the chrome is original. There's a little, little damage here and there in the chrome. Not perfect, so it's not a pristine show car, but it's original. They're only original once. You can go out and buy 100 restored cars. The glue they put on with a brush is still here at the original weather strips. Uh, the dash pad is mint. The fiber optics, I noticed, were working when I came in here. So it's a 327, 300 horse. Original radiator. It's got a stamp on it. So, yeah, the Corvette guys will know a lot more than I do about it. But, again, I can't stress how original, authentic, and correct this car is. And don't take my word for it. There's a box of documentation and judging sheets. Uh, that that tell you it's uh, true. So why don't we start it up? We have 41,815 miles on it currently. He drove it here. It's not a trailer car. He drives it. Runs smooth. Runs very smooth, actually. He was telling me something about these little rubber things here were glued in because the water was going in the car, so then they started gluing those in. There's a lot of neat little tidbits that, like I said, I, I'm sure I forgot half of what he told me, but it was very fascinating hearing it from him, the expert. Yeah, all the fiber optics are lit up right now.
So there you have it. There's my impression of the car, but uh, you don't have to take my word for it. It comes with all the documentation, all the awards. And you can visit volocars.com. We got a uh, much more detailed history and, and information about the car. Um, if you want one of the most original 68 Corvettes in existence, here's a rare opportunity to own one. And especially in the Corvette world, originality means everything. But you can go to volocars.com. Plenty of ways on there to contact the salesman. You can ask them questions uh, or share your concerns with them, and they'll try and help you out. As well as they can get this car shipped anywhere in the world. They can help you finance the car. That's at volocars.com. If you just enjoy watching the videos, why don't you subscribe to our YouTube channel, click on that bell icon, and you'll be notified as the new ones are posted. Thanks for watching.